When it comes to terrifying deep sea creatures, octopuses are pretty intense. They're crafty, camouflaged, and incredibly intelligent hunters who can take on all kinds of different disguises. The ever-elusive octopus has also been known to change color, pattern, and shape, effectively transforming itself into seemingly meek sea creatures for the sake of deception. That means that any innocent-looking piece of rock or coral could actually be an octopus waiting to latch onto its prey. But you already know this. Release the Kraken! There is, however, one other thing that groups of octopuses have been known to come together and do from time to time – slink their way right out of the sea and onto dry land. In fact, there are some species of octopuses that can walk all along the sandy shoreline, propelling their spherical bodies forward with hundreds of tiny suckers on their tentacles, each doing the work of toes. This isn't a mishap or a navigational error, either. The walk is part of this maritime animal's hunting ritual. While one octopus hunting on the sandy banks of the shoreline is certainly noteworthy, though, how about 20? In a startling incident that took place on the Welsh coast, witnesses saw not one, not two, but dozens of octopuses walking right out of the ocean together. Some of them sadly didn't survive the journey, and their corpses were left behind on the shore as eerie evidence for this crazy ability. What makes this event so remarkable is the fact that scientists still don't know why it occurred, or if it can happen again. To add to the confusion, this particular type of octopus, which is called the curled octopus, is actually known for being somewhat antisocial. Spotting these solitary sea creatures in a pack is strange enough, but that goes doubly for spotting a whole pack of them walking on land. In response to the strange three-night ordeal, Julian Finn, the senior curator at Australia's Museum Victoria, told Scientific American, Many octopus species emerged to hunt in the pools of water left behind by the receding tide. He even hinted at the idea that this could be happening more often than we realize since so many species of octopuses are nocturnal. People were also startled this past August when a gigantic octopus began walking around on the shores of Byron Bay, Australia. He appeared to be alone, but made up for it by having tentacles at least a foot long protruding from his oblong body. Some rather brave spectators drew in for a closer look, and much to their surprise, the land-loving octopus began changing colors right before their eyes. Color changing is a relatively common kind of camouflage for octopuses and other sea creatures. In the case of cephalopods, it can sometimes signify feelings of disturbance or irritation. While there's no way to know whether the giant land-bound octopus began altering its hue out of anger, it does make this incident that much more intriguing. But here's a question. How should you react if you spot a massive octopus walking right out of the ocean? Well, if you said, I'd go out collecting octopus corpses, congratulations. You're kind of creepy, that's for sure, but you're also on the right side of science. Cephalopod expert Mandy Reed is urging locals in Wales to collect any corpses left behind after bizarre beach invasions. The thought behind this is that scientists might find clues of the cause in the now rotting bodies of beach-bound octopuses. We already know a little bit about how this is happening, though, and it has to do with how many octopus species can survive out of water due to special gas exchanges in their skin. This works as long as their skin remains damp. The bigger question here, though, is why is this happening? Theories abound regarding this new phenomenon of octopuses strolling beaches together in large groups. Everything from parasites to overfishing, from injuries to recent storms, has been considered. Perhaps the latest creepy collection of octopus corpses will reveal an unexpected cause. For now, though, we're left only with speculation. Check out one of our newest videos right here! Plus, even more grunge videos about your favorite stuff are coming soon. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the bell so you don't miss a single one.